Hey guys! So today and for the next six weeks, we are going to use a website called guidedreaders.com. And this is going to be where you are going to do some activities that go along with the books that we're reading in small groups. Now, today, I want you to practice using this website and some of its different features, okay? This way, you will be able to get more proficient or get better at using the website before we start using it in small groups, okay? So, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to click the link that Ms. Gates has provided to you in Seesaw, and it's going to bring you to a page that looks like this. And you are going to type in my username first, okay? This is going to be on the Seesaw account. So if you forget what my username is, go back and look at that. But it's tgates10, okay? And then you'll hit search. Now, once you do that, it should bring you to a page that looks like this, where it says Taylor Gates. That's my name. And then you're going to scroll down until you find your name on our list. Now, I'm going to click example student today so that I can show you what it looks like. So once you find your name, you're going to type or click on the pictures that are your password. We, as a class, have the password of turtle and pig. Okay, so turtle and pig and then click log in. And it's going to bring you to a bookshelf. So this, imagine this as like a bookshelf in your room and you can read any of these books that you want to, okay? However, when you see one up here in the top left-hand corner, that means that's the book that Ms. Gates wants you to read. Okay, so today, what I want you to do first before you look at any of your other books is I want you to find the book that Miss Gates has assigned to you and read it. So you're going to click read, and that will take you to a screen that looks like this. Okay, and there's lots of options for you. All right, you can read your story. You can listen to your story. So the first thing I'm going to let you do is listen to your story, okay? Then I want you to record your story, which means I want you to press that record button, and then you're going to read it out loud to Miss Gates. And then once you've done those two things, you're going to take your quiz on the book, all right? Now, once you've done that for the book that Ms. Gates has assigned you, you can read any of those books that you would like to today. All right, so I cannot wait to hear the books that you guys are reading to me. Everybody's will be different. They will not be this book. It will be a different book and it will be specifically for you. And I love that. So I cannot wait to hear you read these to me and I will see you guys in a little bit in reading.